So I told myself I was gonna start recording um, things about my fitness prep as well as my um, journey to wellness. So this is me actually recording. I'm just trying to set this up because I literally was about to start like cooking and just going about my day and not put you guys on the game. So this is what I'm doing. Um, it is now 8.32 in the morning. And um, because it's 8.32 in the morning, the first thing I need, I actually am up pretty late. Um, I should have gotten up at like six or something like that. Um, this is my first show. This is also going to be um, my first time falling through with going all the way through with this. So right now I'm getting ready to go to the gym. I have work today. Um, I'm gonna put this rice in the microwave. Um, and we're gonna just kind of follow this journey. So I'm gonna talk this day through as a normal day. And then in the future, on future days, I'm gonna go ahead and like sit, record, talk to y'all about like everything else that's going on. Um, you can hear my motivation in the background because I gotta get myself pumped up. Um, I gotta get my tuna, my breakfast, my dog needs to be walked, all that. Um, but she's gonna get walked when I get back. I'm gonna go to the gym because I wanna get my workout in and it usually takes me about a couple hours to work out. So because it takes me a couple of hours to work out, I need to get there, warm up, work out. I'm gonna really take no rest today, come back, have my post-workout meal. My lunch is actually already made, so that's a good thing. Uh, but I have a mid-morning snack I have to eat as well. Um, I have what else? a mid-morning snack, post-workout shake, um, and I oh, and I forgot to make dinner. So I'm working till nine tonight. I could just go ahead and like make it when I get back, but I'm really trying to stay on top of keeping my meals together. So I'm gonna buy the food. I may or may not have time to make it because I don't want to be running late for work because I get on the bus. So because I'm getting on the bus, we're gonna see how this goes. Um, stay tuned, give me a second, let me go ahead and make this. So this is, ugh, my hair was in my mouth. This is Saturday, it's my leg day. Um, leg day is typically a very long day because I wanna, I've been changing up the way I've been eating and really sticking to my macros. So I stuck to them this morning, ate, had my vitamins, chilled, meditated, um, and just like got my life together this morning so that when I get to the gym, I can be more prepared. I brought a meal with me so I can um, eat while I'm at the gym because I'm literally there like almost like two and a half hours, maybe almost three. But today I'm gonna try to have, I'm going to make sure I do less resting in between so that I can get to my workouts pretty quickly. Also, um, I am going to um, get to this gallon of water today. Um, what's in the water? It's just coloring, food coloring. Um, not food coloring, a Mio. Um, and Mio has no calories in it. And then I add a collagen to it as well. Um, it's a really nice day out here in New York today. Um, so walking to the gym is not as bad. It's not cold. The sweater is even hot. And um, I have my post, my pre-workout meal that I'm gonna use like during my workout to give me energy. Um, I'm gonna go pick up a energy drink. And I'm also going to um, have my lunch when I get back. So that's how today's gonna work. Um, and that's that. I don't have to be at work until five o'clock tonight, which is great. That means I can get my workout in on any other jobs that I look for while I'm doing this because this shit costs. Um, I want them to be like evening jobs because I'd rather work out during the day and take my time per se. So that's what I'm gonna be doing on my off days, which is tomorrow, Monday and Tuesday. So let's get into this workout. I brought my camera. Um, 
little holder so I can put my phone up so that I can record. And I'll put some snippets of that in here. Let's show what I'm doing in the workout. Um, and like I said, I'm doing this for mostly documentational purposes. Um, and for those who are interested in like competing in the future and what you really have to do to get ready for a show. Um, I'm really far out and I was watching a lot of videos last night on how far you really need to be to prep for a show. Um, most people do a 16 week prep. Um, what I like the, what my coach is doing is she's having me um, prep out what well, I asked to prep out this early on mostly because um come on drive let's go let's go let's go let's go um i asked to prep out this early on because i know i have to drop a lot of weight i have to drop like 30 pounds and 30 pounds in 16 weeks is unhealthy so i'd rather prep out more and actually it's not even that unhealthy it's 30 pounds four months is not bad you know but dropping it gradually getting my body used to what I need to work out on building this like I'm technically in like what you call an off season so I'm eating right I'm building the muscle the way I need to I'm learning how to pose I brought my heels did I bring my heels I think I brought my heels I hope I did because then I can go in the mirror in the, in the, in the um, one of the rooms and you know um, practice my posing so that's what today is about and I usually take my time with it on Saturdays. Um, if anything, I'll do again tomorrow. Like tomorrow I'll go to the gym and I'll practice posing again. Um, but I have a couple of Zoom calls that I have to be on tomorrow. And I also want to start parting my hair because I know y'all tired of this wig. I'm tired of this damn wig. And after a while, you're just tired of having to walk around looking like a bum. So I want to look cute. So I'm going to just go ahead and do my hair. Um, dermaplane or get all the extra excess hair but it's called Bella's hair on your face off just you know do some things to make myself feel better because this is a journey that I have been obsessed with when I get obsessed with something I laser focus in on it and everything goes to the fucking wayside so I gotta get back to business so there's some business things I gotta do like doing hair and lashes or practicing lashes tomorrow so yeah Stay tuned, I'm gonna show you guys my workout for today.
leg pump. I feel good. Um, I am going to speak some affirmations to myself. Um, and a lot of those affirmations are like about like um, where I see myself. So one of my first things that I'm speaking to myself for this prep is I made first call outs. I am in first call outs. I'm visualizing myself there. Um, I'm visualiz visualizing myself winning overall. I'm visualizing myself um, in the best physique. Um, I'm visiting myself in a physique that maybe you'll look and you'll think, damn it, you probably are on steroids, but I'm not. I'm in the best shape of my life. So that's that. I'm about to go home, eat this food, get ready for work, and I'll record and I'll put all this stuff up um, as of tomorrow. So Sunday is going to be my edit day.